I want you to imagine that there is a race. And in this race, there are 20 people. They're all competing against each other to win a grand prize, we'll just say. Uh, you can attribute the prize to whatever it is, whatever you personally would really want in life. And in this race, this race is long. This race is like, they've been running for, these 20 people have been running for about 30 minutes or so. And they're all exhausted. They are all tired. They are all in pain. They all want to stop running. And most of them do. Most of them are starting to slow down. Most of them are walking. You know, some, some are like moving super slow. Like, I mean really slow. But there's one person that's still running. He is the most tired out of all of them. But he's still going. In his mind, he's thinking, everyone else has slowed down. So this is going to be easy for me. He just needs to push through the pain that he is experiencing. And then he knows that he's 100% going to win. Now who do you think is going to win this race? Obviously the guy that's still running. The guy that's still going when everyone else has stopped is obviously going to win. So in life, we must do something similar. Let's say, right, all of your friends, you've all, you all have the same dream of, all right, we want to make a million whatever currency is in your country. But all of them have given up on that dream and instead have chosen to get like regular jobs. They've given up on the idea of becoming rich. Are you gonna stop? Cause that's like, that's people that have dropped out of the competition. That means it's easier for you. In life, we must keep running when no one else is. A little personal anecdote. This is sort of how I came up with this saying and how I've applied it to my life. One night, I was up all night. I smoked something that I shouldn't have. And I was tired. I was exhausted. You know, I'd spent the whole night just getting cheap dopamine. And at around 5 a.m., I started thinking, who else is in my position? Who else is here with me right now in this world? And what are they doing? They're probably playing games. They're probably watching YouTube. They're probably eating. They're getting ready to sleep. And I started working. Because of that. Because I knew that the person that I was competing against in that position wasn't going to be working. So I did. I started scripting a video. And like, sure, that video is never going to see the light of day. But I started working. In life, we must examine where we are right now and we must realize that there are people in our same position that want the same things that we want ask yourself what they're doing and figure out how you can do more that's all i have to say today we'll see you in the next one keep running when no one else is